staff, you son of a whore! Watch your mouth, bitch! Ah! Ooh! Mike! You should have a thunderbolt up that ass. Gaming, and we gotta talk to Sid again. Well, let's play Final Fantasy V Pixel Remaster. Well, guys, we lost another crystal. <laughs> the last one at that. All four crystals destroyed, and essentially we're screwed. And oh yeah, Gal's gone. So yeah, he and his granddaughter Cryo went back to their world, and the main villain X Death is freed now. So essentially, it's GG. Well, not really. We have to find a way to get to Gallus World so we can help him out against x -Dead. He's one of us. So, in any case, we gotta find Sid and Mid and maybe they know how to um, get to his world. I mean, why not, right? Who else can we turn to? In any case, since last time though, I did do some grinding and with Gallif out the party, we get more AP! So, yay! Grind to your heart's fucking content. In any case, I did get some really good abilities from my characters, more importantly from the new jobs. Now, for Samurai at level 2, you can learn the ability called Zenich. That is Samurai's main job ability. Basically, you can throw kill at your fucking enemies. Essentially. It is by far the most broken ability in the fucking game. Seriously, especially if you have a max money code, you're set. You just throw money at your enemies. <laughs> it's that fucking good. So, there you go. It's really nice. Oh, yeah, also leveled up Dancer for um, both Bars and um, Ferris. But only, I think only, um, oh, yeah, only got level 3 um, Dancer for, for Bards. However, that did give him the Equip Ribbons ability, which is very nice because it will allow you to, well, equip ribbons. You know, ribbons, the things that prevent status elements. Yeah, that shit. Hmm. Nah, I don't need to. Not yet, anyway. Where are they? Huh? What's this? It's a note from Sid. The animantite left over from the airship renovations is dangerous. Gotta put it back. I hope nothing's happened to them. If they want to return the meteorite, that means... That means what? Well, then again, with all the monsters around, I wouldn't be surprised. I mean, we did get fucking ambushed by a fucking um, adamant toys when we were at one of the tight, um, I think. Was that the Tycoon Meteor right that we went to to get the adamant tight initially? Oh, yeah, 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 it was. But yeah, we got ambushed by a fucking turtle. So, um, needless to say, they might be in trouble themselves. Maybe. I mean,. If they're going back to the same meteorite, that I don't think they have anything to worry about, honestly. We got rid of the turtle problem. Turn us on a handshake! No. No. No TMNT. Not yet, anyway. <laughs> In any case, oh yeah, viewers, there will be jokes about TMNT later. Just so you know. For now, though, we gotta look for our, our friends. <sighs> I assume they're at the meteorite proper. Yeah, I was checking my notes. I thought they, um, okay, first of all, not, not my first attempt at this recording, by the way. Thought they were at, um, the meteorites first. Turns out you have to check the note inside the catapult. Otherwise, you can't find them. The case, hey, it's the Black Chocobo. How's it going? I assume they brought it here. Then again, how else would they be here? Hey, guys. What are you guys doing here? Mike, stay back. It's dangerous. What's dangerous here? A huge wave of power just started flowing from the adamantite. We just thought to put it back where it came from. Hold on. Okay. Why did you put it? Whoa! Seizure warning much? Why would you put it on the warp device? Gala found it on the wall, didn't he? Jumping jolly... Jumping jolly boats? <laughs> Fail. The floor here is absorbing the energy from the adamantite. Oh, I see. Say, do you think the meteorite could be recharging? Yeah, I mean, it's a fucking meteorite. All you gotta do is just plug it into the USB port. 
Then we can charge it to 100% and fly to Gallus World. Why not? That shit always works. If so, we might be able to travel to Gallus, Gallus World. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, this part of the plot makes no fucking sense. I mean, you have a, a giant rock. You put it on a warp device. It acts as a fucking charger for the meteorite. Uh, you know what? Never mind. It's as good as any... We might as well. What are you going on about, kids? That's right, Sam. Ah. So that's your plan. But this piece of meteorite seems too small. <laughs> meteorite. Adamantite. It doesn't have enough power to fully recharge the meteorite to get you to the other world. But if the energy from all four meteorites could be combined... It'd be enough to warp to Gallus World. Exactamundo. Alright, so basically, we have to go to all four meteorites to juice them up. With all the power, we should be able to warp to Gallus World then. Nice, let's go. I kind of wanted to ride the Black Chocobo myself. I mean, not that we need the Black Chocobo anymore because we got the airship, but I wanted to hear the... Be, 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 be. Be, be, be. Oh no! <coughs> oh shit! <laughs> but yeah, yeah, yeah. Pretty much. All right, we're done checking the tycoon meteorite, so let's go and check the um Walsh meteorite next. We don't, if you recall, it's to the north of Walsh, obviously. Hi, are you are still here? <laughs> Who's a good Drago? He's still here after all this time. Wow. Like, what took you guys so long? Um, sorry, bruh, but we don't need you either. We got an airship now. <laughs> Fail. Wait here. Leave it to us. All right. Hashtag go fefe. Mm. Oh, fuck yes. Huh? That's that. Okay, let's hurry. Damn, that was quick. Huh. So, nothing to worry about, I trust. All right, cool. Let's go. Not so fast! It's a boom, 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 boom! Literally. This is time for a boss fight versus Parabellos. Now, Parabellos is by far one of the most annoying bosses in the game. What makes him annoying? Well, you kill one, it'll cast revive, or rather, arise to revive it. So basically, what you need to do, kill them at the same time, bitches! City Edge! Feel the power of my money! But yeah, by using Arise at the same time, they won't be able to Arise themselves because they're already dead! See? See how easy that was? <laughs> wow. Of course, like I said, if you don't kill them at the same time, you'd have to deal with them reviving themselves over and over and over again. Good luck with that if you don't have Zenyage. Are you alright? That was awesome! Tossing money at your enemies is so cool! It literally is. Yay! Alright, to the next meteorite. Let's go! Alright! But yeah, that's a simple boss fight if you have Zenyage. Especially if you have more than one um, party member with Zenyage. But like I said, if you're using a max money code, you have basically infinite charges of Zenyage. Of course, even if you didn't have a max money code, you can still spam it if you have a shit ton of money. Of course, you won't have a lot of money left if you keep spamming it at enemies that way either. So, yeah, use it sparingly. At least, I would say that if you're not using a max money code. As for me, <laughs> I have no issues! So, moving on. In any case, the Karnak Meteorite. It's been a while. Alright, let's go. Hopefully there's no giant bombs or turtles now. Huh. Are they done? Kazooks! Some monster has made its lair in there! Uh, you kids go get rid of it. Why do we have to do it? <laughs> what are you fucking nuts? You expect an old man like me to go in there first? Fuck that! You guys go in there and do it first. I'm too old. Huh, so it's a Bugenhagen situation, isn't it? Yeah, okay. Alright, fine. Hmm. Yeah. The old man floating on a giant green ball can't take out monsters. 
Even though he's lived for over a hundred years! But, okay, okay. That's your grandfather, um, Red. <laughs> what the fuck is this? How's it going? Oh! I sense an earthquake! This is time for a boss fight! Versus Titan! Holy shit, he's a big dude! Titan looks just as buff as he did in Final Fantasy IV. Huh. It looks like Rydia isn't feeding him a lot of rocks this time. Was that supposed to hurt? <laughs> I, I killed him so fast, I didn't even go over his stats. Wow. Broken as fuck. But in any case, Titan 2500 HP, he absorbs Earth, and you can steal the Gaia Hammer from him, but it's a rear st rare steal. So good luck getting it. In any case, we get the Titan Summon as a result. Woohoo! Nice. Not bad. Not bad at all. Woo, much obliged, kids. Now, you can leave the rest to us. Alright. Get her done. And it's already done. Alright, next meteorite. Let's go! Right. Alright, the last one should be at... Hmm. Is it still there? Hmm. Well, the last one would be um at Gone. You know, well, the now extremely ruined town of Ruin. <laughs> so, yeah. We go there next. But essentially, we got the Titan Summon now. Huzzah! Now, unlike when we got Ramu and stuff like that, Titan won't be in the inventory. Instead, it'll just all automatically be in your summon list, so you can summon it at will. So, there you go. That's why I changed Lynn into a, into a um, summoner, because she has nothing else better to work on right now. So, there you go. Let's take a quick look at Titan. Yeah, level 3 summoner. First level 3. Earth damage on all enemies. Very fucking sexy. And in the hands of a mastered summoner... Titan's gonna last us until we get, like, Bahamut. So, needless to say... Oh, yeah, come on, viewers. We're getting a Bahamut summon. Duh. I mean, we got Bahamut practically every other Final Fantasy prior to, to 5. Well, except 1 and 2. Because in 1, he was just, like, a, a you know, a job master or some shit. Why would they make him something so stupid in Final Fantasy 1? Oh, you passed my trials. Um, here's a job upgrade. Good, good luck. Good luck. Wow. I mean, I could have used a Mega Flare against Chaos, but you know, nah, nah. I still, I still don't approve of that Final Fantasy Strangers of Paradise bullshit. They're a little too obsessed with Chaos, honestly. It, it, if that's supposed to be some kind of Final Fantasy One kind of spinoff spoof or something, I, I don't know. It, it just looks failed to me. But, I guess, I guess we'll see when it eventually comes out. Wait right here. We'll be right back. Alright, try not to get eaten by monsters or some shit, because it seems to be like a monster in every thing we go to. Hmm. What's taking them so long? They're taking a rather awfully long time, don't you think? We better go check on them. Right. I mean, I seriously doubt they need help. I mean... Maybe Sid broke his hip or something. My hip! No, no. In any case, before we move on, I want to um, um, put Steel on Ferris. Yeah, those that played the game already know why. In any case, moving on. Not saying that there's a boss in here or anything. I'm just saying I'm just going to equip it just in case. <coughs> oh, shit! Help! Help us! We're trapped and I'm getting dizzy! <coughs> Oh god, I'm about to throw up. Is this time for a boss fight? Yeah, there's a boss. Versus Manticore, bitches. Now, Manticore, the cousin of the drone Chimera. Yeah, he has Aqua Breath! <laughs> Was you expecting it not to have Aqua Breath? Nah, nah, bruh, nah. Now, unlike when we fought Drone Chimera earlier in the game, we have many means of healing ourselves to deal with that. AKA Light Wind Spam. So, yeah, just keep on stealing. See if I can get that. Um, oh, yeah. He has a wind spear that you can steal, along with a dragon fang. 
in this game, the Dragon Fang is a, um, well, it, it, it's not an item that increases dragon type moves, I'll tell you that much. It's a mixing item, I, I believe. So, there you go. Alright, yeah, well, I got the Dragon Fang, I just need to get what I actually really want from this guy. By the way, Manticore has, um, uh, Like, slow the fuck down, thank you. Manticore has 3,300 HP. One Xenius will knock the... I got it already? Well, I got the Dragon Fang. I didn't get the Wind Spear. Hmm, weird. Whatever. Die! <laughs> Money talks, bitch! Damn. Damn. The mightiest of all monsters, killed by money. <laughs> it's so fucking absurd, but it works. You guys remember Amaran's spear change ability from Final Fantasy IX and Riku's spear change ability from Final Fantasy X? Yeah, all came from this game. It was originally called Zenich, obviously. Eh, eh? Final Fantasy IX and X's Zenich, its moves are piss poor compared to the original. Final Fantasy V did it best. Throw money at your enemies and basically kill them practically all the time. Even on bosses. Daijobu. We are now. <laughs> that was close. Daijobu is are you okay in, in Japanese if you didn't know. That's all for meteorites. Now take a look at this map. Alright. What's this? Oh, that's so cool! That reminds me of Final Fantasy 1. Nice. Well, I'm not gonna spoil it, but suffice to say, later on, in, like late in Final Fantasy 1, you get like a, you get a look at, at a map and you have all the energies converging into one point. This is a clear reference to Final Fantasy 1. See where the energies from all four meteorites intersect? That's the warp point. Now get over there. Right. Be careful. Sid, Mid, thank you guys for everything. Yeah. Take care of the black chocobo for me. Huh. Yeah, pretty much. Take care, boy. Aww. Well, see you when I see you guys. I appreciate the help. I mean, we may not be able to come back to this world once we get to Gala's world, so... Uh, well, we'll see! Um, in any case... It doesn't exactly tell you where the fuck it is when you check it on the map, however. Now, I will tell you where it is. You see, it's in directly in the middle. You see where that little thing is that, look like a, that looks like a dragon that's to the south right there? It's directly in the middle. You, it looks like wings. That's where we have to go. That's the warp point. I, I wish I could just show you guys where exactly it is on the world map before getting here. But yeah, it looks just like this. This looks oddly reminiscent of a dragon, doesn't it? Hmm, weird. And oh yeah, viewers, I should tell you this right now. Uh, before we get in here, needless to say, we're going to be in Gallus War for quite a while. So if there's anything that you need to do before hopping into the next world, um, do it now. Blue magic spells, such and such like that, cutscenes, get it done now. You done? Okay, cool, because we're not coming back. So, there you go. Well, maybe. Assuming we can come back. The light is fading. It's all the power that was left in the meteorites. There's no turning back now. You guys sure about this? We might not be able to come back, you know. It's a one-way trip. Meaning not coming back. That doesn't matter. This is more important. Aye, we're in this to the bitter end. Right. Let's do it! Let's go! <sighs> I suppose it's goodbye to our world. Farewell, Chancellor. <laughs> You're the new king, bitch! <laughs> Fuck up, mateys. I know you can handle the loot and pillaging without me. Take care of our booty. Mm, take care of that booty. In any case... Be good while we're going, Boko. Don't get into too much trouble. He's probably going to get laid by the time we make it back. If we make it back. In any case, let's go! To Gallus World! Exos!
So we're essentially in the middle section now. Uh, I I hope we land on something comfy. Hmm. Where do we? Oh damn! Well, at least we know there's grass in his world. Of course, why wouldn't there be grass here, dumbass? <laughs> this is Gallus World. Hmm. Where exactly are we? We're on a fucking island. Oh, new achievement. Whole new realm. Nice. This world. Oh, even the world map looks different. Well, of course, we're in another world. Duh. Dumbass. In any case. Yeah. Look at it, viewers. Wow. So, what exactly do we do here? We're, we're on a small little fucking island. Hmm. Well, the game does not tell you this. So, what you're supposed to do is use a tent. How are you supposed to know this? I have no fucking idea. But take my word for it. Hashtag Kofefe. Mmm. Oh, yeah, baby. Mmm. <sighs> Lena, there's something I've been wondering about. It was way back when we were on North Mountain. Why'd you risk your life to save that Drake? Hmm. Do you remember Mother? Eh? Hmm. I. A little. Whenever I see Hire You, I'm reminded of her. What do you mean? Huh? What the? Oh, shit! Green Devil! Monster, look out! Lena! Ferris, no! Aw, oh, damn! Uh-oh. You're next, bitch. Shit! The fuck is this guy? The abductor. <laughs> you think you're gonna abduct me? Get out of here, bitch! <laughs> 6,900! <laughs> you got 6,900, bitch! Huh. Ooh, a treasure chest. I wonder what's inside. Oh! Scass! I can't feel my legs! My leg! My leg! And he died. We just got here and we're already in jail? Huh, okay. Interestingly enough, viewers, if you happen to lose to the abductor, I don't think it's a game over. In fact, he just brings you back here, so... Whether you win or lose against the abductor, you still get kidnapped. Where are we? Huh. Well, at least we're all together. <laughs> Welcome to my castle, bitches. You. Extra! How's it going? Huh. Lord Xtef, Gallop and his cohorts have made it to the big bridge. Big bridge? Sounds sexy. Hmm, fortuitous timing. Prepare the giant mirror. Yes, my lord. So, what, what, are you gonna do your hair in the giant mirror or something? Perhaps I should thank you. You are about to become quite useful to me. And I don't mean in a sexual manner. Here you are, sir. Ah. Uh, Mirror, mirror on my sexy ass floor. Mike, look at the sky. A bird? It's a burb. No, no, wait. It's our reflections. Hey, there they are. Grandpa, look. Mike, Lena, Ferris. What the blaze is going on here? Um, yeah, Gallup, we kind of got kidnapped. And yeah, we kind of disobeyed you and came to this world, so... Um, can you help us out? <laughs> Stand down, Gala. One more step and they die. Damn. He's in a giant mirror. This is such a threat. Hell's bells. Everybody, get the fuck back. Yeah. Um, run! <laughs> well, that sucks. 
Gilgamesh. Gilgamesh? Sir, watch them. See that they don't try anything. They probably will, so if they do kill them, I, I really, I, I, I honestly could care less. I'm free after like 30 something fucking years. It's time to stretch my legs. Ugh. XF, you son of a whore! Watch your mouth, bitch! Ah! Ooh! Mike! So a thunderbolt up that ass. <laughs> Cry on borrowing your Windrake. They got Windrakes here? Mike and the others need my help. Besides, I'm a chosen one. Release the Windrake! Yes, sir! Is Gala some kind of royalty here? Oh, I love this theme! It's the theme of the Dawn Warriors, by the way. Look it up on YouTube, it's so cool. Take care! Try not to die, you're kinda old. <laughs> no, 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 I'm just kidding, but yeah. Can Gala infiltrate XS Castle by himself? Wow, even the mountains look different in his world. Uh, uh, good boy. Thanks, boy. Go back to crawl, okay? <laughs> Who's a good drago? Uh, well, I'm in. That's what he said. <laughs> but yeah, literally, that's what he said. Hmm. What's this? Wow, they put all of our shit in one chest? Stupid. What well, is it? At least we know that when we got abducted, they li XF literally took our shit and put it away. So that way we wouldn't have access to them as soon as we get here. That's pretty cool because in other Final Fantasy games, they don't take your shit. So, yeah. Hold on, guys. I'm coming. Literally. In any case, yeah, we got Gallif back, bitches. In any case, we gotta go save um, Bart and the others. But can't Gallif do it by himself? Find out next time. You guys enjoy it, you know what to do. Hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel for gaming bits from me. And of course, when you subscribe, be sure to hit the bell so they're notified of my newest uploads. Got something to say? Of course you fucking do. Leave a comment. Until next time, dudes and dudettes, this is Mike from Rage Break Gaming. I hope your rage breaks. Have a great day, my bros and bitches. Smile you later.